Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jazz Nicole and I'm here with another natural hair video. So in today's video, I am going to be doing a product review on some products that I received in the March 2021 curl box. But before we get started, make sure to subscribe to my channel and click the push notification button so you can see when I upload some more videos. The products that I'll be using today is from Palmer's Cocoa Butter and Biotin Length Retention Line. And this line was formulated to prevent breakage and fortify strands with nourishing flaxseed, quinoa protein, cocoa butter, and aloe. So I'm starting off with the Length Retention Shampoo. And this retention shampoo is a gentle shampoo that lifts away dirt, oil, and buildup, has no harsh detergents, and won't strip or tangle hair, strengthens and maintains moisture balance, and leaves hair cuticles and follicles perfect for conditioning. shampoos get like really I guess like sudsy because it makes me feel like okay my shampoo is working and it is getting all of that dirt and build up out of my hair So this Palmer shampoo is silicone free, has no parabens, mineral oil, gluten or dyes and I think that's so important when looking for a shampoo to make sure that it doesn't have any harmful products that will strip or dry out your hair. As I was rinsing out my hair, my hair was not tangled at all and it was actually really easy for me to run my hands through it and my hair felt very moisturized. Whenever I'm rinsing out shampoo, I want to make sure that I get all the product out before my hair is ready to be conditioned. So I just use my shower head and just go all through my hair to make sure all the shampoo is rinsed out. Next I'm using the Length Retention Conditioner. And this conditioner is a rich and creamy silicone free conditioner that effortlessly wraps the hair shaft creating a protective shield deeply strengthens, hydrates, and instantly detangles, and enhances hair shine, manageability, and overall condition. I wasn't really feeling the conditioner. I don't know, it just wasn't giving me what I was looking for in, in terms of like manageability. I felt like my hair was still getting tangled. Towards the front of my hair, I was able to finger detangle, but the front of my hair does have a different curl pattern in the back. As I was rinsing out my hair, I don't know, I didn't feel much of a difference when I was rinsing out the conditioner like I did when I rinsed out the shampoo. So the conditioner, I'd probably give about like a, mm, I don't know, like a 6 out of 10, 5 out of 10. But the shampoo, I would definitely give like an 8.5 out of 10. As I was rinsing out the conditioner, I tried to use my fingers to detangle my hair so that it'd be ready for me to use a deep conditioner. Next 
Next up, we have the Length Retention Deep Conditioner. And this deep conditioner is a silicone-free deep conditioner that deeply penetrates to nourish each hair fiber, strengthens to help prevent future damage, moisturizes, detangles, and softens, and improves shine and elasticity. So this deep conditioner kind of helped redeem this line because even though it was a little hard for me to finger detangle, once I started rubbing in the conditioner or the deep conditioner, it helped make my hair a little bit softer to manage so that I was able to twist it. My hair was getting a little dry so I made sure to um, wet it some before I started adding the deep conditioner and then I also continued to add water even with the deep conditioner in my hair. This made it easier for me to section my hair and also finger detangle. To use the excess uh, product on my hand and just rub it in at the roots of my hair just to make sure that I'm getting all of the deep conditioner in my hair. Now I'm just going to clip my hair um, and put the shower cap on. The directions say to leave the deep conditioner on for five minutes so I'm just going to I guess chill in the shower and then wash it out. So now it's time to rinse out the deep conditioner and I'm not gonna lie, this actually like helped make my hair a lot easier to finger detangle while running, you know, rinsing it out with the water. Um, I really like that my hair, like you can see my curl pattern just coming through and honestly my hair felt so moisturized and just, it just felt like brand new and I was loving that. I would probably rate this deep conditioner, I would say like a, between an 8.5 and a 9 out of 10. Um, it definitely was doing what it was supposed to do. It gave my hair some TLC that it needed. My hair always needs TLC for some reason. But I definitely like how this deep conditioner had my hair feeling after rinsing it out. Y'all, my hair is looking so healthy, so strong, and it feels so good after using these products. I would definitely give this line about a, mm, probably an 8.5 out of 10. Honestly, the conditioner is what threw me off, but the shampoo and deep conditioner, I actually really loved, and I can't wait to use that again. Let me know down in the comments if you have used any of the Palmer's Cocoa Butter Length Retention line. Uh, I know it's fairly new, but I would love to hear y'all's thoughts on it. Thank you all for watching this video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Until next time, bye!